one of my most favorite trends of 2019 is the neutral muted desert tones monochromatic trends you saw a lot of this in chloe acme studios my favorite was burberry hello everyone and welcome back to my channel welcome if this is your first time here i mean you guys are on fire i take a two-week break from youtube and i come back and there's 2800 new ones of you here welcome i am so happy to have you here i'm sure that i have spoken to a lot of you in the comment section below whenever i'm answering back to comments i still haven't been able to respond to every single comment i took a three week break where i just didn't film all i did was i spent time with my family and with my friends right now i'm in miami i really hadn't been home in a year so it had been one year since i hadn't seen my mom and i just really needed to like nurture myself back to you know being positive and having a lot of energy and being rested and here we are and i am so so happy and i am just very very excited for everything that this year has to come i know everybody says oh my god 2019 is going to be my year blah 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 well 2019 is going to be my year and it is also going to be your year because it all depends on the way that we think and the shift in perspective that we are going to have moving forward this year i'm not going to get into that in this video now i'll do another video for that but this video is going to be about a couple of things that i got the last three weeks by the way guys i didn't do a what i got for christmas video because i didn't get no christmas gifts no one gave me a christmas gift and i didn't buy myself no christmas gift one of my most favorite trends of 2019 is the neutral muted desert tones monochromatic trends you saw a lot of this in chloe acme studios my favorite was burberry so i inspired myself in those shows to go and pick a few pieces that i could bring into my wardrobe to complement the things that i already have i'm going to start with the most exciting one of all the purchases it's a chloe bag this is actually my first chloe bag i have never owned a chloe bag before the new chloe test bag this one is actually brand new for this season i just love the color so this is the new handbag that is super hot right now this is the chloe test bag this is an a sepia brown i love this bag it's so pretty i like how it has the mixtures of gold and silver hardware it also comes with so you can just you know it has this small handle so you can carry it like this and it also comes with this a very long strap it's really cool you can put it on you can do a crossbody it's uh inside it looks like it's, I mean, it's pretty spacious inside. I can fit camera, phone, makeup. I can fit a bunch of stuff in there. Actually, maybe I should try it so you guys can see. And it's just beautiful, guys. Look, it falls perfectly on the hip. It's a mixture of this beautiful calf skin with suede. And this is the new uh, upgraded version of the Chloe Nile bag. I still love the Chloe Nile bag and I don't own one, but I am planning to get one because it's really pretty and it's just really flattering with everything. I like this color because this color goes with gray, camel, white, anything muted, brown. It's beautiful and I don't have anything in this color. I have a pair of boots which are exactly the same color, but I didn't have a bag for it. So now I am happy that I'm going to be able to wear both of them together. The next items I got were these three necklaces, which are very minimalist, very dainty, very delicate, and they're all in real gold. This one is 14 karat gold with a half a moon is 0 0.06 carats of diamonds. This is yellow gold, and why a moon is because, as my friend says, our emotions are ruled by the moon. Then the next one is this rose gold 14 karat gold necklace with a heart this is diamonds also 0 0.06 carats and because the heart is a heart and the third necklace i got was this yellow gold this 18 karat yellow gold 
it's a little bit longer and I wanted it because I wanted it to go with this pendant which I've had now for about a year and a half this pendant is uh, rose gold with diamonds and honestly I don't know if it's a boy or a girl I just really love it it's just a little person there and I just love how all three of them look together now let's jump into shoes so I've been wanting a pair of ankle booties and I wanted them either in uh, like a camel color or I wanted them in um, what do you call this oh leopard let's just call it leopard I love this it's real it's these were from J crew and they are very very comfortable actually these ankle booties are from j crew i love the heel it's a super comfortable heel and then this is how you put them up it just has a zipper in the back which makes them super comfortable to put on and take off and they are made in real it's like you know real pony hair they just look great with gray jeans or black jeans or anything in the muted neutrals Next pair of shoes I got are these suede gray pumps. I have been wanting a suede gray pump forever, but if you don't spend $800 or $700 getting a Jambito Rossi one, it's going to be really hard to find one because nobody makes them. And I found these in a place where I never shop. I got these at Ann Taylor and they look absolutely phenomenal because this is the drop of the foot it goes very low and you can see the front of your toes a little bit so it makes your foot so beautiful the shape the heel is a 10 um centimeter heel i believe i'm gonna put it all below and it's so comfortable and i'm gonna tell you something guys because i actually have the receipt here this shoe is on sale right now and if i really suggest that you get it I mean, I loved this one, but they also had it in leopard and in black. It's, it used to be 128 and now it's $51, so I'm going to leave the links below if you want to get it. I got mine in a size 7. I usually wear 38s, but these run very true to size and they fit amazing. Another piece that I got in Ann Taylor where I never shop and I am just surprised about, you know, the things that I found there right now is this brown coat i'm not crazy about the fit in this coat i wish that it had a collar here because when i do this my neck is still out so the color is perfect is exactly the color that i was looking for that perfect chocolate brown i don't think i'm going to keep this however i will still link it down below since we started with coats i'll continue with coats you guys I got this coat and it's so cute. Look at this. I It's not real sheep fur, which I want the real cheap fur one, but the Max Mara one is like 3,000 something dollars. It's a lot of money. So I'm actually trying to get a factory that I have produced a lot of things in the past with. I'm trying to get them to make me a real sheep's wool coat because I mean, they just look so beautiful and they're really really warm but this one it's not real this is fake it's from a brand called some days loving which i have never ever ever heard about it but i went into nordstrom and it's super nice outside is very nice so if you can see so far we are going in this very neutral muted trend situation see the two coats and then the boots and then the gray, right? You're, you're following me here, right? And then look how beautiful this looks with the bag. The next piece I got is this sweater that I am wearing. It's 100% cashmere. I got it in Intermix and it's like an off-white color. I love it. It's so soft. And what I really love about it is that it's a v-neck and it's a deep V. And that is short. Um, it's not too short. It's just like right underneath my belly button. And this allows me to wear it with high-waisted jeans or high-waisted pants and maybe tuck in the front a little bit or just wear it with uh, to work with a skirt, like a pencil skirt. And it's just a very flattering um, length and it's a very flattering fall. Right, talking about cashmere. I got myself a little cashmere. I think it's cardigan. What do you call this? I don't know. I've always wanted one of these things. 
I had never gotten one just because I just all the ones that I find I always think that they're like frumpy looking this one is from Vince and it's a hundred percent cashmere and it's super thick guys super thick and I love it layered on top of this I loved it I love it layered on top just of like gray gray on gray it's just a great piece if it's like you know if it's winter and maybe you know you're not outside so you take off your coat so now you're inside so you can stay with this or you know just transitioning into spring or for summer this is something that you can wear all the time it's beautiful the color it's beautiful the neckline is beautiful the finishing is beautiful it's so thick i'm very happy with this it's going to be a great layering piece for me next piece is i got myself a gray t-shirt you're gonna be like maria why the hell would you get yourself a gray t-shirt because t-shirts are amazing they're amazing i live in them i love white t-shirts but i love gray ones especially now with this monochromatic muted tones muted desert tones trend that is coming in hard this year so this one is from madewell and it has a little pocket and it fits amazing you guys i have never bought something from madewell i went in there jesus like a lot of their things are really nice they have a lot of basics that fit really really well i'm super happy with it and i think it was it was 1950 it was 1950 i haven't washed it i don't know how it's going to react i got another sweater and this one is from j crew and i love it because it's cashmere and it's not that expensive girl i got it for 128 dollars yeah and this is camel and it has a really deep v-neck which i love and it's not tight it's kind of like loose but not really i think j crew cashmere is always such a great value for your money i have some j crew cashmere for years and they look the same next piece of investment that i got i like the word i just used investment i am trying to be smarter with my shopping because i want to build a capsule wardrobe a very minimalist capsule wardrobe i don't want to be you know i don't want to have a lot of things i don't have space for a lot of things and there's a lot of things that i don't wear so i want to be able to make my wardrobe of things that i really 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 love and like everything else i'm literally just gonna get rid of it i've already started I got myself a new pair of denim and these ones are from Rag and & Bone and they are high-rise skinny jeans so they go I love look how cool this um like uh, blue fade they go all the way up to my waist and I love this this I just love then last but not least we're down to two pieces and they are scarves I got this gray scarf and I got this camel color scarf and they're oversized they're really really big now i got these at zara i got these at zara i went in there and i found them it's massive it's just the bigger the scarf the better because when it's cold you don't want to feel that cold <laughs> or get sick so yeah i mean it goes it's so much bigger so i got this one at zara and the camel color one as well but i'm gonna tell you something about these scarves if i can find it online and i can link it i will link it so you guys can get it what i don't like about these scarves is that they are made out of 70 percent acrylic and 30 percent polyester for me that's an allergy guarantee 100 percent. i just have to wrap this around my neck for a good half an hour and i'm gonna be like sneezing and like you know just my ears are gonna start itching so i mean they're beautiful if you can wear them more power to you this this um camel color one is beautiful it feels like a little itchy it doesn't feel very soft and anything that's going to be around my neck and like rubbing in my face all the time i want it to be soft i want it to be breathable so preferably cashmere or a wool a blend of cashmere with wool or maybe camel hair which is also really really warm but you know it's very soft so let me tell you i found them and they are on their way here now and it's basically um a gray scarf and a camel color scarf from my favorite brand sui studio they have like this super chunky oversized scarf and they are not expensive i think it was like 120 dollars or something but 
when they get here i will show them to you and if i find them on their website i will link them down below but girl you need a camel scarf and you need a gray scarf if you don't have one in your closet you need one that's gonna be around my neck and like rubbing in my face all the time i want it to be soft i want it to be breathable so preferably cashmere or a wool a blend of cashmere with wool or maybe camel hair which is also really really warm but you know it's very soft so let me tell you i found them and they are on their way here now and it's basically um a gray scarf and a camel color scarf from my favorite brand sui studio they have like this super chunky oversized scarf and they are not expensive i think it was like 120 dollars or something but when they get here i will show them to you and if i find them on their website i will link them down below but girl you need a camel scarf and you need a gray scarf if you don't have one in your closet you need one i said the last two pieces i showed you were the last ones they're not uh there's this that really doesn't really fit into this um i wouldn't say this is a hole but you know what i mean um because they're not winter items they are swimsuits i got two swimsuits because i am in miami i got this one this comes up to your waist it looks so pretty it's like old school and it goes with this um oops it's the other way around it goes with this top it looks so cute if you head over to my instagram you're gonna be seeing pictures with this swimsuit because I was out in the beach this weekend and I was wearing it and I took some pictures and the next item I got is another swimsuit this is just a plain black swimsuit and it's really high here on the sides and I love that the back it's low because when you have the really high uh, sides like on the hips and the back is low it just makes you look like you have a little waist like you have a nice butt it kind of slims you down this one is from solid and striped and it's super comfortable i'm super happy that i got it as for all my videos i'm going to be linking down below everything that i have on this video everything that i have shown you i also want to make an announcement guys oh my god brace yourself and um i'm gonna i'm gonna need help even voicing this one out to you so i've decided that i am going to up my game and i'm gonna start posting three times a week now instead of two times a week i'm gonna be posting on tuesdays thursdays and sundays so wish me luck because i'm going to need it i am so happy that all of you new girls are here well guys too and i can't wait to see you know where this journey together is going to take us this year i'm gonna come at you guys with a lot of styling videos one day of the week i want to throw in there a vlog of whatever i've done during the week let me know if that would be exciting for you like if that's something that you're interested in watching i mean i can't tell you my life is always exciting because it's not i work a lot so but you guys can actually get to see a process of you know how i work and what it takes from you as uh, an entrepreneur to actually put your ideas down and execute on them until you see them flourish which will eventually turn into you making money so that's actually what my life is all the time when i am not recording so if you're interested in seeing that then let me know and i'll make sure that one of my videos during the week is a vlog where i actually share with you guys everything about you know my business and uh, how I grow it and how I think about it and how I execute on it and how we you know brainstorm new ideas actually my life is also about you know eating healthy and working out so if you want to see aside from my personal life then you guys can tell me and I'll put that once a week in a video vlog and then the other two days I'll do styling and something else we'll figure it out I send you guys a big kiss and I see you guys very soon. Bye.